This is News Always On. Sports fans in North America are sharing the opportunity to host the 2026 World Cup after FIFA voters overwhelmingly opted for the financial and logistical certainty of the United States led bid over a risky Moroccan proposal for the first 48 team tournament. The soccer showpiece will return to the US for the first time since 1994 after gaining 134 votes, while Morocco got 65 votes at the FIFA Congress in Moscow on Wednesday. The vote by football federations was public, in contrast to secrecy surrounding the ballot by FIFA's elected board members for the 2018 and 2022 host, Russia and Qatar, in 2010. Born in Orlando, soccer was hardly e even a thing in Florida. Now in Orlando, it's the main sport, even ahead of basketball. Um, having a new team has really helped, but it's just getting the World Cup here in North America is showing how it's growing in, in, in the region. I think with all the people that are coming to the games, they're definitely, I guess, bringing more, more people to, to the games, which is, help, which is helping to kind of sprout a new generation that has interest in, in the sport. North America is optimistically promising to deliver 14 billion in revenue, while the tournament won't require major construction work required on the 16 planned stadiums, all of which already exist. Swamp America and come and, and support and be a part of the World Cup, and I think it'll just give everyday Americans a chance to interact with the rest of the world in a, in a sport that everyone loves. Among other venues, the Mercedes-Benz Stadium in Atlanta is expected to host semi-final games. I think that uh, soccer will become more popular for our generation. I know, uh, especially in the United States, soccer is one of the less popular sports. And uh, I think that it's a good way for us to get more interested in the sport, our generation. I would say the impact for 2026 for the average soccer fan in, in the States is, is going to be huge. Um, we've got a lot of great opportunities, a lot of good teams coming to MLS, a lot of good teams for for just the you know the National Cup. While the U.S. didn't necessarily make it in this year, we've definitely got a, a lot of really good team members on there that can really push for the for the next World Cup come around, and then hopefully by the time 2026 we can represent the represent the U.S. proud and strong, and you know at least make it to the group matches. You know, having lived in the U.S. and uh, being French, uh, not at the level where we live it in Europe, of course, you know, or maybe in Latin America. Uh, that being said, I think it's uh, it's probably increasing, right, with uh, lots of uh, younger uh, younger children actually taking up the sport. It's a beautiful game and it's a great opportunity to bring it even to the next level.